not enough liquor in my cup to look at what we're going to look at. I'll repeat that. There's not enough liquor in my cup to look at any of this. That's every. That's all day. Look, man. This uh, this market is going to make me a bear. It's going to convert me into a. I was a bear once before, and then I just got a little bit more excited about being a bull. It was a bull market. Now, it's a cry yourself to sleep market. So, if you guys follow my other videos, I have been in VaxArt. That is uh, where I've been since last week, mostly in VaxArt. I do have some calls in Microvision as well which are you know they've got two weeks on them two and a half weeks i'm not super concerned about them vaxart i got some calls that expire friday and a bunch of shares so what is vaxart what do they do well they are a vaccine company that develops vaccines and cures for things like covid and other viruses and they're developing oral pills for vaccines which sounds amazing there's a lot of uh hype around this right now if you can just take a pill, way better than going to get a shot, right? We can get pills in people real easy. Uh, also easy to disperse amongst a lot of people. And if it's not harmful to you to take it, then it should be readily available. To be able to get them, you know, with ease at CVS or Kroger or Publix or in the mail or whatever, right? So it seems to make sense. Now, whether they get approval or not is another thing. Now, keep in mind that the vaccine that's out now only has emergency emergency use approval. Does not have F, FDA approval. Just emergency use, which everything right now is emergency. So why is Vaxart tanking? Why is Vaxart down right now 17%? This is crazy. This is madness. The stock price currently is, I want to move this over, $7.38. Sitting at 725 after hours. The only thing that's giving me hope right now is this four hour chart. And I'm going to have to scoop this up here so you can see it. When I zoom out of this four hour chart, let me look at it. All right, see what we got here. This is where we're at. This is the last like nine days, right? Going back to the 26th. This right here is back in January, February. We can only hope that this little bump that we're seeing, so that's my cursor kind of off base for some reason, is the entry point to this right here. Maybe, maybe not. They had earnings. They had this conference. Maybe it's just a false hope to want to believe that, but I want to believe it. You know, right now there's just no volume in the after hours, which is fine with me because the after hours plays have been rather disappointing, but everything today was red. I, I would be hard pressed to look across a watch list and find green, right? Vaxar, another pharmaceutical, Skills, Upstart, Endeavor, Load, Amaris, Mavis, Romeo Power, Eyes, Fisker, Novavax, Fubo, Naked Brand, Yala, Laser, Microvision, Excel, Riot, Coinbase, everything's down. Plug, Sundial, I mean... It takes a long time to find some, some some green in here. So if you're looking for if you're looking for an idea, buy puts on stuff, man. At this point, at some point they have to turn around. It's just at this point there's no floor. Everything just keeps falling. I said this. There was a floor, and then we found a basement. Now we're in the basement. And then hopefully in the basement, we can find the stairs and come back up to the floor and then maybe get the hell up out this house. But at the moment, we're in here looking for a cellar below the basement. And this is just crazy as hell, man. This is nuts. So if you're looking for advice, I don't have Doge. Doge is the advice. Buy Dogecoin. Doge is sitting right now. This is a wild play, man. Oh, it's so at this point, just buy Doge. Doge is at 64 cents. I don't know what happened here. I was uh, working. I, I missed this. I would have set a freaking buy order on that bad boy. 56 down to 55 down to 
potentially filled a 50 cent order and be back up to 64. I don't know if that's like a, a glitch or, or what that is. Uh, that's pretty wild. But right now it's at 64. Look, I woke up last night and I had some doge. And I, I sold the doge. It says sell limit on it. And then I woke up and I was like, look at this chart. I'm, yeah, it's like 2 in the morning, 3 in the morning. I'm like, oh my God. Like this. I'm like scrolling through like, why is doge coming at? That's how you know you have a problem. And you wake up in the middle of the night and you're scrolling for Dogecoin. And I was like, oh man, 69 cents. I'm like, oh man, I might go to like, I might go to a dollar. Might as well buy it. So I just bought more Dogecoin at 69 cents, like a jackass in the middle of the night. Half asleep, more than half asleep. But look, man, if it goes up to a dollar, cool. Then you got 30 cent profit on your investment i'm still up on doge i'm not up like some of you guys man some of you guys want to are hodling to a dollar and you are well on your way and it's unbelievable and i've heard so many stories from other youtubers that had like <laughs> half a million doge coin dude freaking trade mode james said he had half a million doge coin and he sold it for a loss <laughs> <Dude>. <laughs> Could you imagine? Like, not a big loss. It was like, I don't know, it was like 30 bucks or, I don't know, 300 bucks. I don't know. He said he sold it for a loss. Dude, he would add 300 grand in Dogecoin right now. <laughs> this thing, it's a, it's a target out of a freaking million dollars. Half a million dollars in Dogecoin. There's going to be a lot of regrets. And I think there's going to be a lot of FOMO from people who sold and also what makes it go up is simple it's easier to buy than it's ever been you buy it on weeble you buy it on robin hood you can buy it on binance you can buy it on voyager you buy it on all these things i'm gonna put links to uh the ones that i use below they're free to sign up all of them give you a benefit to signing up too all of them so voyager gives you like 25 dollars in bitcoin uh, Weeble gives you like two free stocks, Robinhood two free stocks, TD Ameritrade stock. I mean, everyone gives you something for signing up, right? That's how it works. Um, I have yet to buy the Doge on Weeble, but I have bought it on Robinhood. I didn't have any problems. Um, I have bought it on Voyager. I, I will tell you this. If you watch my video on Voyager, you'll see that the bid-ask spread is pretty high. That's why it's free to trade on Voyager, because the bid-ask spread is is so uh so high meaning when you when doge is at 64 you're going to pay 66 and when you when it's at 64 and you want to sell it you're actually going to sell it for like 61 or 62. so you need to use the limit orders if you don't use the limit orders you're going to be uh disappointed for sure um, so keep that in mind you can easily swing trade it especially seeing what we're seeing now with the doge i mean if it's dropping seven eight percent just just factor in the percents into your into your gains and you'll be fine so right now if it's at 64 and it's on a tear and it goes back up i'll probably sell i'll settle sell limit for 70 cents or 71 cents and then i'll buy another dip but we'll just keep building up a little bit man you can build 20 bucks a day or 80 but sometimes i get 80 or 100 dollars a day if i'm paying attention to it and it's moving so keep that in mind. Check out the links in the description. I will put them all in there if you'd like to learn more about trading any of these things, even some of the options trading or just some of the stocks or how to use how to use the platforms in general as far as just buying and selling stocks or placing limit and buy orders or market orders or any of those things. Leave me some comments. Let me know what you'd like to learn and uh, we'll, do, we'll get after it, man. Maybe we'll do like a live, uh, a live podcast on it and just walk you through it that could be easy to do too um, so i'm here for that but other than that hit the like button hit the subscribe button if you want to be notified when new content comes out hit the notification bell and other than that i'll see you guys next time